We are excited to give you a new strategy this week on the head and shoulders pattern rules. Do you want to know how to trade the pattern? Are you looking for an effective head and shoulders price pattern strategy? Then you came to the right place. These rules will show you how to identify head and shoulders pattern bullish or bearish trend. Sell entry criteria. Head and shoulders trading strategy. Rule number 1. Head and shoulders price pattern rules. Find an uptrend on your chart. Once you have established that there is an uptrend look for retracement then another bullish push price action. Rule number 2 look for retracement then a bullish push to a new high. The new high will be the head. What you will now need to see is the price move back down to form another shoulder before making another run to the upside. Rule number 3 wait for another retracement. Then another move to the upside. No two head and shoulder formation will look the same. Sometimes there will be a little noise which may make it hard for you to see. Take your time analyzing the shoulders chart pattern and you should be able to accurately spot these formations. What is happening here is when the price targets approach the neckline from the head. Many of the people who bought the last wave were soon of the realization that there are plenty more sellers than buyers right now so they are getting out. Rule number 4 price action should now move downward to neckline. So now, since the buyers are all getting out of this to minimize their losses, the sellers take over the trend and drive it down. The neckline is simply the place where the price will touch and then head back to the upside in this example. We can confirm that is was the proper neckline because it touched this at three different places. I marked these areas with the green arrows so you can confirm what I am saying. Rule number 5 Wait for price to break neckline. Now the moment of truth is when the price action gets to the neckline. This is a crucial moment for the sellers to get on board. As you can see the neckline was broken here so now you are set up to make a trade. Rule number 6 Entry Criteria Wait for a small retracement, head and shoulders target price. Before you enter, wait for a small retracement. In this example, I bumped down to a 15-minute time chart to make my entry. This is a great idea if you have identified the head and shoulders target on a 1-hour time chart. Rule number 7 Stop Loss, Take Profit. This rule goes hand in hand with rule 6. Make sure you determine a stop loss placement before you enter a trade. There are many different exit strategies that you can use with head and shoulders. I recommend you go for a 1 is to 3 risk to reward ratio, similar to what our trend breaker strategy uses. So, determine your stop loss and calculate a 1 is to 3 risk reward ratio. That was the criteria for a sell trade so here are the rules to trade an inverse head and shoulders pattern. Buy entry criteria. Inverse head and shoulders target. Rule number 1. Find a downtrend on your chart on any time frame. Rule number 2. Head and shoulder indicator. Look for retracement then a bearish push to a new low. Rule number 3. Wait for another retracement, then another move to the downside. Rule number 4. Price action should now move upward to neckline. Rule 5. Wait for price to break neckline. Rule number 6. Entry criteria wait for a small retracement then enter the trade. Rule number 7. Determine stop loss and use a 1 is to 3 risk reward ratio. You can see an example of a buy entry GBP USD currency pair taken on a 5 minute chart. Conclusion The head and shoulders price pattern strategy is great for any time frame. I showed you examples of a trade that used a 1 hour chart and a 5 minute chart. Never trade this strategy until you see the break of the neckline. 
I could show you countless examples of the price hitting his line but not breaking it. This method is not perfect. But if used correctly should be a great addition to your trading system. The 1 is to 3 risk to reward ratio is nice because even if you have a few losses, the winners far outweigh the losers. The head and shoulders indicator is yourself with this price action strategy. You decide when to trade, not an indicator. Too many traders want indicators to do all the work. Or, they want to be away and have a robot trade from them. If that is you, then this strategy will not work for you because you need to put the work in to reap the benefits of this strategy. Thanks for watching. As always, if you have any questions about the head and shoulders price pattern strategy, feel free to ask in the comments below. Also, please give this strategy one like and subscribe if you enjoyed it. Press the bell icon on the YouTube app and never miss another update.